Hello and welcome back to the MacU Athletics Christmas Connection. I'm Sports Information Director Adam Stanek. With me today is the head coach of the men's soccer team, Danny Fred. Danny, how are you doing today? Good, thank you. Danny, I'm going to ask you some really challenging questions. I know you've probably had a lot of them asked already, but this one, these are Christmas themed. First one is, what's your favorite Christmas movie and why? Um, I'm actually not a big movie guy, but um, growing up it was probably Home Alone because I liked all the pranks. But now um, Christmas looks very different with our daughter and she loves The Grinch, so I've probably watched The Grinch 10 times in the past couple of weeks. Uh, which Grinch movie would you say you like? It was the it's the animation version, whichever whichever version that is. Like the original yes, Grinch, yes, like yes. one way back in like the sixties yes. or something. Gotcha, gotcha. She just loves it. it she is, just a loves it. is a classic. It is a classic. So, uh, next question I have for you is: What's the number one thing on your Christmas list this year? Well, I saw Coach Muller's, and she mentioned Botox, which got me thinking that I probably need some Botox as well after this season. Um, but no, it was to go home, and I am going home for the for the first time in four or five years, and and taking our daughter home for the first time. So I got my Christmas wish. Uh, for those watching, where are you originally from? Uh, about an hour above London, a small place called Rawnstown in Northamptonshire. Well, I'm, that should be pretty exciting to get home yeah. then for the holiday. Yeah. Uh, next question I have for you is, uh, what is your favorite Christmas tradition? Christmas tradition. I've had different ones because growing up in England and then the last 11 years being here. Um, but going home, uh, my dad normally cooks like ham and egg in the mornings and then we don't eat until Christmas dinner. Um, and then we have our nan and gran and everyone comes over and we still um, pull Christmas crackers and wear Christmas hats at the, at the dinner table. So I'm excited to do that again this year. Okay, the last question I have for you is uh, what sort of Christmas greetings or wishes do you have this year? Um, well, I see all of our players with their families at home and it just makes me so happy. Um, we've got players that have been, been here, I don't want to say stuck here, but been here for the last two years, couldn't go home. Um, and getting those pictures and, and seeing them on social media, being home with their families, just, just makes me really, really happy because they've been here a long time. So, And I suppose after last year too, with the COVID year, a lot of them are probably yeah. going home. And, uh, and you've got uh, how many from how many different countries? We've probably got over 20 different countries and we had 60 players this year and I'm pretty sure nearly everyone has gone home, including all of the coaching staff. If, if they haven't gone home, they've had family come in here and see them. So everybody's getting out and spending some time with family. All right, that's great to see that they're going, being able to go home this year. So uh, that's going to do it with our interview with Coach Danny Frid. Danny, um, wish you a Merry Christmas Thank and a you. Happy New Year. Uh, for those watching, the Evangels, coming off one of their best seasons in program history, went 19-1-1, one one, won both the SAC tournament and regular season championship, and uh, definitely looking forward to next year. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you too, Danny. Thank you.